week one endocrine system. Um, if you'll watch this, of course, that's a you'll get a kick out of that. You've already clicked here to see this. Is please watch after motivation video. So to get you started, there's lesson one point one all the way through um, one point nine. Now, these lessons are broken down into different subjects. This is called chunking. You take a big subject, it's very complicated, and you break it down to smaller sections. Um, there's always going to be, and it's going to look a little different when you're doing it, there's always going to be an introduction here, a little bit about the learning objectives, and then it's going to go on to <laughs> your computer freezing up. No. Um, it's going to go on to whatever the subjects are. Like, you're going to want to read through this. You see pictures, you can click on them, make them bigger. You'll go through, you'll read through um, all these subjects, prostaglandins, those are interesting, hormone interactions. Now, here is the very first, this is quiz 1.1. This counts as a grade, okay? Um, they're low-weighted. So I want to say they're 5%. They're set to keep your highest grade. You have two attempts. And I'm getting distracted. Let me just check and make sure. I believe we're all good. Yes, you should be able to see your answers after the quiz post. So you're going to want to work through all of these lessons. Like this is 1.5 parathyroid glands. There's an introduction. There's some subject matter. Here's the quiz. All of these have an ending part that tell you, you know, why it's important kind of thing. They play a role here and there. So um, you're going to want to go through and work through. Oops, sorry. Um, actually, you're going to want to work through all these first. This is um, it's called study hall. It has a really detailed here outline. And then here are some videos you can use if you're confused on certain topics. These Some of these are really good. Crash course is good. All these cover the different um, glands and organs and things like that. So as far as assignments go, all right. So you're going to have, um, oh, I didn't mean to skip over that. So here's the lesson. Now, this is a soft chalk lesson. That means you can do these as many times as you want. These are, I believe, 10% of the overall average in this course. Um, you can make the little uh, three arrows go away. Well, three bars. You want to make the menu go away. But all these question types, here is um, it's going to give you a little information about each thing. You can go over it. And it should tell you here. It's overview. Uh, there's the pituitary gland, thyroid, thymus, all that kind of thing. This is a labeling activity. You can redo these. You hear the doink, and that means you need to start over. If you ever doink one, it's not going to give you full credit. Um, here is a thyroid. So it's going to do this and drop it in there. Now, if you're having trouble with the screen size, you can do what's called control minus. The control is the bottom left. The minus is up by the backspace key. And you can make these smaller if you wish. Being old and blind, I usually have it like that. But control minus, control plus will adjust the screen size. These are drag and drops situated in the sphenoid bone in the skull. Let's see. Um, where is the pituitary? Hmm. This is anterior. It'd be the whole thing, um, basically. Uh, superior metas mediastinum, that should be the... Um, hold on. Let me pop right there. Yeah, it just dinged me. Um, anyway, but you'll have to start over if you hear a doink, but, um, just work through these. You can do, um, what does that say? My, um, oh, okay. Okay. Huh. That's interesting. Well, um, this is match the correct terms. You can do drag and drops over here. Anyway, you're going to want to work through all of this. You can redo every question. You can redo the entire lesson if you want to. Um, yeah, I don't know why that says assignment question, blah, blah, blah. But um, I'll look at that after off the camera. So these are cards you can flip over. So it gives you the um, information on the back, effects of cellular hormones on cells. 
Uh, I'm not even going to look. I'm just going to guess here. Look, see, I got that wrong. Um, let's see. Blah, 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 blah. Well, it's actually this one. But okay, so I just read the question. You can redo these as well. You can redo entire question groups. So there's a video here on, on different receptor types, but here, um, oh my goodness, you can, I'm using my mouse to rotate this down, but um, these are, um, um, okay, there, like a little card, you turn them around, did I turn this down? I should have made a ding sound. Let's see here, let's see if I can do I get, no. Hmm, well, I don't have the sound actually for that one, I guess. And then here are some questions. Anyway, you get the idea. Just work through the entire uh, lesson. And once you've done that, now I didn't cover this. Up here, um, this is a lab folder. You're going to click on that. It says video, please watch. So there's going to be a video here. Hopefully it'll pop up. There it is. There is um, an outline associated with each lab section. And that's what you're going to use to prepare for the lab exam. These, you can download them. I'm just doing the quick view here. This is what you're responsible for. That's going to correspond to the uh, video that you're going to be watching here. Um, this breaks down all the categories of the different lab subjects. Here's pituitary gland. As always, you can click on something, make it bigger if you want to. That's a really detailed you know, here's the pituitary. It's separated into a front and back. There's actually a third lobe as well. But you'll want to go through, and I did not mean to exit out of all that, but you'll want to go through for the lab. This is everything you're going to do for the, um, the lab exam. There we go. All these subjects. These do not have quizzes. Um, that would be a little bit redundant. But once you've done all the lessons... Then you're going to want to and do those first, do the quizzes first. You'll want to do this lesson first, a soft chalk. Then take your lab exam and your lecture exam. These um, modules will open. Um, they'll open up on Sundays, and you'll have to the following Tuesday to complete everything. So that's the module one. Please email me if you have any questions.